Hey guys, uh, what's up? Just wanted to drop in uh, and say hi. It's uh, a snowy Saturday morning right now in March. We just wrapped St. Patrick's Day, which means spring is on the way, uh, even if it doesn't look like it. And if spring is on the way, then that means that it's, it's almost new music time in Toronto with CMW. Uh, Canadian Music Week 2017 is going to be huge. We've already found out that we're going to be at uh, more than 30 venues, or there's going to be new music at more than 30 venues this year. There's bands uh, from all over the place uh, that are going to be playing six nights in a row, uh, and afternoons, and at parties and showcases, which is a whole lot of information and music to take in, uh, but it's totally worth it. If you've, if you've never done CMW before, we highly recommend it. There's so much to take in and so much new music to uh, discover and, and bands that you love are going to be there too so you can kind of slide a night or two in where you know what you're going to get uh, and you can be ready to sing along and party. In the past we've had uh, the opportunity to see country shows at Boots and Bourbon with Kira Isabella and Cold Creek County and, and Chris Lane and Rivertown Saints, all kinds of, of awesome country acts. Uh, we've had the chance to... Uh, see some rock and roll shows, including uh, an amazing night that uh, that we won't ever forget with Scott Weiland at the Mod Club uh, before he passed away, and the opportunity to meet him in the green room after the show uh, at the at a show that had uh, Josh Beach and the Luke Austin band on it as well, uh, which was a lot of fun. We've been in the Dakota late, late, late at night on a, on a weeknight to see JJ Shiplett for the first time, which has turned into uh, an opportunity to see him again and, and to hang out with him a couple of times, which has been a whole lot of fun. Overall, there's just a lot of great music. And uh, and we know that this year is going to be the same. We've already posted, I've already posted uh, about three shows that uh, that I don't think you, you want to miss. The Honest Heart Collective uh, with Texas King uh, and Silver Love Club, who uh, are formerly Mabel, uh, our boys from Australia. They're going to be at Adelaide Hall. Uh, we really think that you should check out the Great Hall for some country with High Valley and Madeline Merlot. Uh, there's so much going on. Uh, and then at the Horseshoe, you're going to have the Beaches with the Dead Love, uh, another Aussie band who, uh, who like to throw down. We've, we've had a chance to hang out with them as well uh, on a sunny patio. Uh, and those boys do love a Caesar. Uh, it's. I think it's why they come back to Canada. Um, either way, the, there's just so much. Grab a wristband. Uh, keep an eye out for contests. I can't promise you that we're gonna have something to give away, but it's uh, there's there's always an opportunity which you should stay tuned for. Uh, we're gonna have pictures and reviews and videos. Keep track of our socials. Trisha will have her camera out. Uh, we're gonna look at interviews and and features. All those good things. Uh, and we know there's going to be some amazing talent. So what I want you to do is just keep track, stay tuned, uh, and open your mind to some new music because there's a whole lot out there and there's an opportunity for you to really connect with some artists and, and become a, a fan on the ground floor uh, before they really hit it big. Uh, enjoy your weekend. Enjoy your Saturday. Hopefully the snow stops soon and, uh, and we can get to spring. Talk to you later. Peace.